What's up everyone? It's Storm and Oh. Never mind. Uh we play FNF Paper Mario Origami King. Oh yeah. It's a go. I really want to play the Origami King, but I'm poor. So kind <laughs> of contains multiple language options. Okay. That's useful. Esta dispondo en multiples idiomas. Yeah, I don't Okay. Let's -a go. This looks so good. So if you don't know the premise of Paper Mario and the Origami King, there's this evil origami person named Ollie who is trying to fold everyone. And oh, okay, let's start. And he's just trying to turn the world into origami. And that's obviously not a good thing because Everyone's bodies is made of paper, and I'd imagine them being bent is painful. So. Oh yeah, and then his sister Olivia helped us. Boyfriend and a disfigured girlfriend arrive at Toad Town, where the origami festival is taking place. However, for a festival, it is unusually quiet. In pursuit of finding a way to turn his girlfriend back, the two head down Picnic Road. Oh, hey there! You must be new! Luckily for you, you ran into the greatest musician in town! Beep. Don't believe me? Alright, let's have a little friendly competition! Right here, right now! Come on, just one quick song! That's how I imagine a toad sounds. Yay! Cause they sound like, Mama! Three, two, one, go! go. Oh my, this is relaxing. He's playing a clarinet. Oh my god, I could fall asleep to this. Oh my god, yeah, that's so nice. The song is called Picnic Road. And we get coins! D did I collect the coins? Did I get them? I can't tell. Uh... Not bad! You're pretty good at this! But, uh... I can't help but notice that your friend there was folded! Okay, I'm gonna stop now. I might know someone who, hug who could help fix her. Well... Yeah, our local hero, Mario. He's your best bet if you want any help with your girlfriend. Papu. After he unfolded me, he went up to Overlook Mountain. It's further along this path, so he probably took the cable way. Beep bat. Bye, friends! Hope you find Mario without any more trouble. Oh, battle. Stop right there. Oh. Bat. It appears we missed one. We'll make sure you are creased. Your hero won't be able to save you now. Three, two, one, go! Oh yeah, this is the battle theme! Wow! I love this song. 
The battle mechanics of Paper Mario and the Origami King is interesting. Because you're on like a circle. So we're fighting a spiny, a shy guy, and a goomba. Oh, such such a such a such a sussy baka of goodness. Twas very nice. The course clear. Cut the coins, boyfriend. What are you doing? Crazy motherfucker. Anyway, after an easy encounter with the goons, they disappeared and turned in the coins. Also, both and so both of them continued their journey to Overlook Mountain. At the foot of the mountain, they spot the cableway the Toad was talking about. Crab rave. <laughs> it appears to have just returned, meaning that Mario couldn't be too far away. After finally getting to the top of the mountain, they spot the station, along with a cabin waiting for their arrival. And there's the colored pencil box. Beep. What a pity. This cable way is out of order. You're not going anywhere before I get to my revenge. That red hairy dwarf. He thought I was gone for good. But well, I've got some time to deal with you two before I leave this world. Prepare yourself. So we're fighting the ghost of a pencil case? The style maestro. This is the boss battle so you can get to the red streamer. He literally fires colored pencils at you like missiles. But up. Okay, yeah, this sounds really good. Obviously not the best song in the in the soundtrack, but it's still good. And Ellie's girlfriend can still bob her head. And I don't know how the hell Ollie managed to fold her, because you know, she's 3D. She's not paper. At least I hope she's not. Otherwise, boyfriend is banging a piece of paper. Course clear. Ba -ba -dum. Coins. I can't believe this. Me, Jean Pierre, colored pencils the twelve. <laughs> Defeated by two midgets in a row. You'll pay for. The colorful specter vanished out of existence with a bright glow. Still in shock, boyfriend gets on the cable with girlfriend as they proceed to ride to Autumn Mountain. For their sake, let's hope Mario isn't too far ahead. To be continued! Okay, we get it. We get it, we get it! Shut! Uh... Uh, I think we have time for the orange streamer or whatever's next. I think it was yellow. Chapter 2 Blue Streamer. The boss here is literally just a bunch of rubber bands. So. Oh, I get it, because they're all paper. Okay. 
Boyfriend and girlfriend arrive at the beautiful site of Autumn Mountain. They look around to see if they could spot the hero in red, aka Mario. However, the calm and mystical illusion was shattered as soon as more full dominions came into view. Oh, a hammer bro, a paratroopa, and a ninji. Boyfriend is unfazed, considering the last encounter. Hey you there, where do you think you are going? Uh, beep. This is where your path truly ends. Prepare to face our wrath. Three, two, one, go! On a mountain done. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is the same as the last battle, but it's more like a flute. Oh, now I'm- okay, now I'm remembering why all those cans are in the river behind us. There's a stupid monkey on the- on the mountain over there. Oh, and I forgot to get to fight the monkey. Booyah, I defeated once again. Course clear. Beep. More coins. And boyfriend's not collecting them. What an idiot. Anyway, uh, who said that? Hey, you. Hey, you, kid. Oh, wait, but oh, there's a toad on a climb in the mountain. Yeah, you. I saw you back there giving those pesky folded dorks what they <laughs> deserved. That's quite the accomplishment. Bop, beep, skidap, boop. Hmm, Mario, you say? Of course I know him. He unfolded me, so I carried down the river to scorching sandpaper desert. Beep, skidap, boop, boop, bop, boop. Sure thing, mate. <laughs> Hop in and I'll give you a friend a ride. While riding along the river, the toad broke the silence. Hey, kid. Would you mind doing something for me while we get there? Beep. Are you up to give it? How are you up to give those vocal cords another go? Doing the same route every day gets extremely boring. Boop beep. Excellent. Singing in the rapids is going to be quite interesting. Mind the logs and stones. Crashing in them could be fatal. Eddie River. Press space to switch lanes. Oh, that's neat. <laughs> oh my god, this is so soothing! Okay, so... Bum ba dum bum bum ba da dum bum Oh, I could fall asleep to this. All oh, the Paper Mario games are so nice.
dun, 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 dun. Oh, and that's it. How? How? Wait. How did? Force clear. Oh, hush you. More coins. How? Wait. How was the speaker on the boat? I think that'd be too late. Good job, mate. I haven't had anyone with lungs like you for quite a while. Beep. All right, we're approaching where I left Mario. He left to go after the next street. Mario? Suddenly, a rubber band monster tips the boat and nabs girlfriend, sending boyfriend and the river toad off the edge. Bah! But oh, it's the river, rubber band guy. You me? You mean that little shrimp who had the nerve to shoot me off my stage during my big debut? He didn't even make sure I was gone for good. I need a new audience for my second show. You three will make great faces for the crowd. Beep. Now get over here, you little... Seeing boyfriend's mic awoke something in a deranged entertainer. Oh, another performance, I see. You like a little song and dance? Mad beep. Want to know what works perfectly with that? Drama and action. Let me set the scene. I, a monster, have kidnapped you and your beloved, and you are forced to sing for your combined freedom. That is literally what is happening right now. Oh, but there's a twist. You won't make it out alive. Beep. Oh, 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 my writing is unmatched. Let's see what you got, lover boy. Let's fight the elastic entertainer. Oh lord. Let's save girlfriend. <laughs> this is literally the battle music in the Elastic Entertainer's fight. Because they're all about drama and stuff. Yeah, this sounds so good. All these songs sound good. I apologize if I'm quiet, I'm just trying to focus. Did I win yet? Yay, I win. I beat the Elastic Entertainer. Course clear. More coins. What? That wasn't in the script, you maggot. You were supposed to lose. Were you not listening to me? They appear to be even more furious than before. And out of pure unfiltered rage, the actor's rubber bands began tearing apart. I guess this was my final curtain call. Well, 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 you insufferable rat. The fiend then exploded, sending girlfriend into boyfriend's arms. Unscathed somehow. Wow, a performance. Anyway, what a performance. Sorry. Anyways, aren't we heading to Sandpaper Desert? Or do you want to hang out here in Shogun Studios for a while? Eh, alright, Mario. <laughs> well, hop back in. Continue in Chapter 3. Want to see me play chapter three? Like, subscribe. You know what to do. Uh, just tell me in the comments. 
And if you don't do it, I'm gonna play it anyway. Because <laughs> there are six colors to the ribbons. What can I do with these coins? There seems to be no one here now. Oh, for now. Oh! Foreshadowing. Alright. That's gonna call it for today's video, y'all. Happy Friday. We getting freaky on a Friday night. Uh, Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious.